a smaller amount uh, of our European citizens. But um, I believe we are very relevant because we are uh, a very visible part of the face of Europe. And, um, and we are, uh, as Maria Gabriel said, uh, a key attraction for the cultural tourism and which is often uh, in lost parts of rural Europe, which have other, uh, no other uh, employment possibilities. Uh, we are so relevant for the cultural identity of Europe that many of our houses are in one way or another officially protected. But every country in Europe has different legislation, protection schemes, subvention rules or taxation rules uh, for our type of houses. Um, we were therefore very happy that uh, in 2012, in the last EPBD directive, a very pragmatic approach was taken to let the decisions on adoptions of this directive uh, for heritage houses um, to the member states. Uh, and I'm very happy that our very good paper has taken the same view. Let's stay pragmatic because we want to save all of these houses. Um, we are great supporters of the Green Deal and the renovation wave. Top. Uh, we understand more than many others what sustainability and heritage really means. It's not just words. Most of our houses have been passed on mostly in the same families for hundreds of years. And we still want to live in them keep them open for the public for the next hundreds of years. This is sustainability. And if there is a group of buildings who are actually the predecessor of what people say today, environmentally friendly, take a look at ours. They have been built before the creation of steel and concrete, who in many cases is imported from somewhere over the ocean, which consumes a huge amount of CO2. They were built to last for hundreds of years, not to be torn down 50 years later to construct something else. Most of our buildings were built carbon neutral, or probably, I'm not a technician, you could even call them carbon negative. They were built with stones which were found around the house, somewhere in a quarry. They were built with timber, which was nurtured for hundreds of years locally, and which incorporated CO2 for hundreds of years and who are still there. They're still in the house and they will still be there for another hundreds of years. So please keep that in mind as well. Um, we are your private clients. Uh, we are impacted by many of uh, the decisions, but we want to be part of the decisions. We want to be part of the Green Deal. We want to be part of the renovation wave. And we thank you very much to bring us in and uh, to let me talk today, continue like this. Thank you very much.